People tend to think that the history of art is all about looking at things, but sometimes, quite frankly, it really helps if you know how to pronounce something. There are names we always get wrong, and the best example of that is Vincent van Gogh. How you pronounce his name depends on where you come from. The French, for example, would call him Van Gogh, the Americans Van Gogh, and in England we've settled for Van Gogh. But he was Dutch, and I've spent hours with Dutch people trying to get this right. It's something like Van Hoche, but it's not that easy, so I'm happy to say Van Gogh. I'm Richard Stemp, and this is London Art Studies.